guys <laughs> all right um welcome back to my channel guys um today we're gonna do another q a with me um so today's q a the questions are based on my actually relationship with <laughs> the guy <laughs> i don't know man but most of you guys you guys are weird why would you just request that one video like you know I'm not comfortable to talk about it, but you went ahead and requested the video. Like, who does that? Okay, it's not like I'm denying the person in public. I'm not de denying anyone in public. I want to make one thing clear, though, you know. This, th this video might be there. And then relationship on the other side might not work out. But all I know, I love the person. You know, I love the guy. You know, and there's no point of me hiding this feeling to the world. You know, people should actually know that you don't have to hide if you love someone. You know, feelings is something that you cannot hide. So, therefore, we're going to kick into the questions and then, yeah. But don't laugh. Don't laugh. If I ask any question wrong, Joseph, please just take it. Okay, that was really bad. Hold on. So, first question first. <sighs> Who are you dating? Oh, I got, oh, are you in a relationship with? Okay, so his full name, his full name is Joseph Abinda. Yo, Babembe people. Majina yenu kweli. Yeah, you know that. Anyway, that's his name. Where was he born? Oh, it's funny because we were all born in the same place. Congo DRC Baraka. Which year? Hmm. Hmm. I won't tell you though, but his date of birth is the 3rd of April. I can't give you the date. I mean, the, the year. Because I just can't. You know, some things I gotta keep them private. <coughs> Alright, so yeah, that's that. How do we meet? Okay, so guys, I feel like that's a whole new video. So, to help you know how we met, I'm gonna make another video on that. How we met. And then, yeah, that will help you guys to know us better. You will meet him one time, yeah? You meet him one day. I might post this photo with, along with the video, but if it doesn't work out, then I'll just... You guys have to wait till the day we are together, then we can do a video together, then you get to know him. What's that? Okay, so... <sighs> the thing is, is it a morning person or evening... Um, morning or night person? Yeah, it says morning or evening person. I don't know. Actually, no. I don't know. I'm not sure. Sorry, I'm not sure. Uh -huh. Is he good at making friends? Yeah, he's very friendly. He's actually very friendly. You know, the good thing is, he doesn't talk. He doesn't talk like that. He's very humble. Oh, now I'm describing him. Anyway, uh, is he good at making relationships? Okay, yeah. Like, really good. He is more than good. He is great in making relationships. Oh, yeah. Is he my weakness? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Guys, yes. Joe is my weakness. Yes. Yes. Oh, my God. <clears throat> I should describe him, him in three words. Humble. Wise. Mm. and one more word is a very humble is very wise and is very caring slash supporting you know yeah okay so his nickname i call him joe um yeah that's why i call him joe i don't call him joseph mostly i just call him joe for short you know, does he love kids? Wait for the next three years. We will tell if he does or he doesn't. Because in that meme, in that way, we all don't know that yet. He can just tell me on the phone, oh, Rachel, I love kids. I'm going to have this. How many kids are we going to have? And then you talk about it. And then when the day comes, 
no one is there to help you y'all you're there by yourself you know so that's no good um the question is does it make me a better person you know every time i'm around this person he keeps on reminding me that you don't need to rush with life you need to be patient he's the one man who deal with patience very well you know sometimes i can just lose patience but he's that one person who never gives up on anything when he says something's gonna take place he doesn't care if it's 10 times and i'm here just thinking like i want it to take place tomorrow he's there thinking of 10 times 10 years to come you know so he's very 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 patient you know uh, so in this sense he makes me he makes me a better person he gave me sometimes there's things that he says to me and it makes me questions back then they made me questions who i was how i used to live and how i live now so there's the things that he has done in my life which he he's not sure about he's not aware of but i'm aware of those things you know and i believe the same way i've impacted his life as well but i can't speak for him it's better if he speaks for himself you know no? um how long have we dated uh we've been together for five years guys five years this year september 8th that was like five years of this relationship um how many languages does he speak three if more it's four but three for French, we are all learning that. He speaks three languages. Kiswahili, Kibembe, English, French is on question mark. 50%. You know, we are Congolese, but that French, well, we don't speak, you know. Um, he has five siblings. Okay, so he has five. He has three, no, four sisters and one brother. So they're all together, there's six of them. Three in Africa, three in America. I know my people, you know. Yeah. Ahem. <clears throat> So if we get married, where would I take him for a honeymoon? Oh God, Singapore, man, Singapore, Dubai. Or take me to Africa. Let's go to Zanzibar, you know? So, yeah. Cool, next question. Um, What is he great at doing? He's a good musician. A very good musician. All right, guys, I'm going to leave those questions there. But um, the thing is, I want people to understand that We've been together, but, um, I mean, we're dating. We're in a relationship for five years, but this guy is in America. I live in Australia. So our relationship is an international relationship, you know. It's in a long-distance relationship. Therefore, there's some habits, which I don't know yet. Till I live together with a the guy, then I'll get to know about them, you know. So there's a few things that I can answer. I wish to answer some of these questions, but I feel like to answer them correctly, once I'm married, I'll be able to do another video. So that I can answer all the questions properly. But right now, I'll just answer what I know. I answered what I know about him. And once we are together, then I'll do more. Because then I will know him better. Because we all live together. We all, yeah, you know what's up. But as it is for now, that's all I want you to know about him. We are dating. We've been together for five years. I live international. is in America. I'm in Australia. Um, What he loves doing? Music. He's a really great guy, you know. He's a great guy, you know. Is that one person will sacrifice anything for anyone you know that's a, that's what i know for sure they will sacrifice anything for anyone that's him um he doesn't talk and when he does he speak wisdom this is why i say if you have to scrub him three words wise humble and very 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 caring person is just there is down to earth and i actually thank god for him being part of my life for him being in my journey, I really, 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 really appreciate the Lord for actually bringing that person in my life. You know, things like this come and go, but he sticks around in time of need, in time of hardship. He's always there, you know. Um, so every time I have a problem, I call him first, I talk to him first, and then whenever decision I have to make, he has to know or he will help me out. So i need a best friend and i have a best friend in him that's what i will say i have a best friend in him i'll find a best friend in you know soon to be uh you know yeah so really guys that's all i can share it's nine minutes already so enjoy the nine minute of this conversation and have fun i know i wasn't laughing today so much because this was kind of a, a little bit serious but next time when we do another one, I'm going to make sure we're all laughing and things like that. It's about time you guys discover how dumb I can be when it comes to African countries. 
presidents, flags, and all that. I'm really dumb. And what it is like growing up in African homes. I'm waiting for all these videos to come so I can go on TV and watch myself and just laugh. But for today, I'm going to end it here. Enjoy the video. I hope you're going to enjoy the video, guys. And I'll see you guys in my next video, which I don't know what it will be on about. But I hope it's another great video. And really, keep sharing. Keep sharing the love, the video, the everything. And sorry for the noise in the background. You know, I live in a house of 12 people. So you got to understand, mm -hmm. this is not only my house. Mm -hmm. This is my parents' house. I have siblings. I have a mother, father. Everyone is a lot to talk. So every time you hear noise in the background, just say no. You know, focus on what I'm saying. And thank you so very much. Be bless y'all. And it's Sunday. Happy Sunday, guys. You know. Bye, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.